I know James already for eight years. James came with an idea. Rodrigo, I like to do a personal story about my life, uh, about my youth. I like to picture you. And uh, I, I have a kind of relationship with uh, Donald Trump's family. And why James? And he's pitched me. Oh, I studied in the public school. I was expelled of the, the public school. I moved for a private school. And the head of the council of this private school was Frederick Trump Sr. And, uh, and the, the Trump family was really involved in that school. And he started telling me stories about the family and, and how he saw that and how important to, to him is try to tell that story, his personal story, and show how the United States were in that particular time and explaining about racism, explaining about the social uh, differences and everything. And the picture was so good. And I think, James, this is a so personal movie. I, I think this one is a special one. Yeah, I see you coming back for your origin. And I like to do that. I like to be on board with you. Let's, let's go. Let's go. And uh, we are trying to do other film, but that became in the front line. And we started doing this one first. Yesterday I was seeing him directing the actors on the table and uh, he was mentioned how was his breakfast and his brunch. And it was so beautiful the way he describes for the actors and seeing the actors portray his family. And he's telling, no, they eat like that, they look like that, they talk like that. And uh, on my tables are these and that. And uh, it's a kind of, he's reviving his story. And so, I think because he's giving everything in this, with this heart, that may be going to be the warmest James Gray movie. James, since the beginning, Anne Hathaway was his choice to play the mother. I think Jeremy Strong right now, it's, um, everyone is talking about him. In Brazil, he's a successful uh, character as Kendall Roy, and, uh, and have him doing other role and giving a chance for an actor like him who is portraying big roles on TV shows but not in the films with a director like James Gray. I think it's a very good choice. It's a different choice, not an obvious choice. Um, Anthony Hopkins is a dream. Maybe one of the biggest actors alive and in the, the last 40 years. He's considered a genius. For me, coming from Brazil and working with these actors as a producer, I remember seeing them on, on screening. It was a, such a dream to work with them as Anthony Hopkins and making a film with him right now. It's like okay, I'm doing something greater. I, I'm working with Anthony Hopkins. I'm going to put in my life, I work with him. And on this film, with a, such a personal character and such a, with beautiful scenes, you could imagine what's going to happen.